it's really important to think about cutting back or quitting uh, tobacco use for a number of reasons. It gives the most bang for the buck in terms of making a, a life change. Uh, tobacco is associated with numerous diseases, not to mention folks feel better when they're not using tobacco. There's less cough, sputum production, shortness of breath, uh, taste and smell improve when folks quit using tobacco, and uh, energy levels are improved. Quit With Wake Med is a specialized tobacco cessation program that encompasses um, a team-based approach. We have advanced practice providers who are supported by supervising physicians and they bring contemporary pharmacotherapy to the table for patients who wanna work on their tobacco use. We have behavioral health counselors who are backed by psychologists and psychiatrists to help with the behavioral element and the psychological addiction of tobacco. This approach has been shown to be the most beneficial and have the highest success rates. It's a complete package. Um, it's, it's comprehensive, it's individualized, and it uh, focuses on best practice and, and highest standards of care uh, to offer patients tools for cessation. It's extremely helpful if a patient is interested in cutting back um, or quitting uh, as they come into the program, but it's absolutely not necessary. It's uh, an opportunity to gather some information on, on smoking, on tobacco use and its consequences, and on potential tools for uh, quitting or cutting back. And I don't think it's ever a bad thing to be informed. A patient coming into the program can expect an initial visit with an advanced practice provider, a PA or a nurse practitioner, uh, that lasts about 45 minutes to an hour. And during that time, the APP, the advanced practice provider, is going to take a detailed history of the patient's tobacco use over the years. They're going to discuss uh, smoking patterns, uh, quit attempts in the past, and barriers to um, potential cessation. They're going to prescribe um, some, some sort of plan, uh, likely to include medication, but it doesn't have to include medication, and arrange a follow-up for about two to three weeks. The APP is also going to offer a behavioral health referral so that if a patient would like to, to utilize that portion of the program, um, it, it's an option for them and readily available. Thank you.